guys would have parlayed competitive matches on heat and velocity into being signed full-time to WWE. But that's not how things turned out. It's like my wife Brie likes to say. If anything was easy for me, I wouldn't be Daniel Bryan. But before I could become Daniel Bryan, I was Bryan Danielson. And as Bryan Danielson, I went on quite the run through the Indies. Over the course of seven years, I won my first world championship and had some amazing matches against guys who went on to become major WWE superstars. Guys like Seth Rollins, Cesaro, all sorts of guys all over the place. A lot of hardcore fans even say these were some of the best matches of my career. Personally, I credit these matches and opponents for helping me build the foundation I would later need to make it as a WWE superstar. Fans on the indie scene weren't the only ones who took notice, because in 2010, WWE re-signed me and Daniel Bryan was officially born. My name is Daniel Bryan. I've been wrestling all over the world, and finally, finally, I have an opportunity here in the WWE. Although much like childbirth, as I've heard from my wife, this was also a somewhat painful experience. I came back as part of NXT, which wasn't like the NXT that you know and love today. At the time, NXT was a reality show with rookies and pro mentors. Unfortunately, my pro was The Miz. People will say that you're great, that you're a star, that you're ready for the WWE. Do you think you're ready? Yes, yes I do. But one thing you have to learn about the WWE is you have to expect anything. I guess he misses by beating a little bit of respect into his NXT rookie. Believe it or not, we didn't get along very well back then either. I think the most ridiculous thing we had to do in NXT was the obstacle course. Okay, so you're gonna do the monkey bars. Then we go in the ring and juggle. Juggle. Then you're gonna see how fast you can drink soda. Side note, it was actually supposed to be a hot dog eating contest. When they realized I was vegan and they didn't have any vegan hot dogs, they turned it into a soda drinking contest. I didn't know vegans could drink soda. Not drink at all. I hadn't drank any soda in years. Think, watching that on TV, a grown man just drinking soda from a cup. That's it. Despite that, I did have the tremendous opportunity to show the WWE Universe what I was capable of when I got to face the World Heavyweight Champion, Chris Jericho. I loved watching Chris Jericho from the time I was in high school. The stuff that he did in WCW, being able to go against the World Champion on NXT on the first show. Win, lose, or draw, that elevates you. And I was very thankful for that opportunity. We're on the inaugural episode of NXT, the World Heavyweight Champion Chris Jericho taking on the Miz's rookie, Daniel Bryan. I've been looking forward to this main event. WrestleMania is on the horizon, but tonight is a, is a WrestleMania of sorts for all the NXT rookies. Well, Daniel Bryan was excited earlier in the night to be out on the biggest stage of his life, but that was before he knew he was going to face the World Heavyweight Champion. He's going to have to learn to take Miz's advice if he wants to survive here. I have to admit the NXT rookies have been fairly feisty tonight with their WWE pros, to say the least. But there's been no bigger offender than Daniel Bryan. Bit of ungratefulness shown on the part of Daniel Bryan. To say he wasn't pleased to have the Miz as his WWE pro was the real slap in the face tonight. He's got him covered. And Jericho pops the shoulder up. Too yeah. soon. Returning to Daniel Bryan not wanting the Miz as his pro, I do see Bryan's point. Daniel has a career performing in the ring that is twice as long as the Miz. But he hasn't been in the WWE, Byron. The Miz is well within his right as a pro, as a mentor, to show Daniel Bryan motivation through humiliation. He wants to do this in the ring. Big time slam right there. 
Brian's been known to be a submission specialist on the independence, but Jericho has a few holds of his own to watch out for. Listen, Daniel may be a submission machine, but you don't become a star in WWE without charisma. Brian can't come up with a better catchphrase than The Miz because Daniel Bryan is not awesome. Daniel Bryan has the personality to make paint dry. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Nothing pretty about that elbow. Despite all of his actions from earlier tonight, I do have to respect... Whoa, he, he works his way out. A bit of a Houdini job right there. His kick connects. Got some air on that senton, guys. Right to the face. I think things are about to get turned upside down. I think you are correct. And now he goes for it a second time. Oh, I'm thinking the champion is starting to realize he underestimated this rookie. Jericho's in trouble. Can we be seeing a monumental upset? A monumental upset would be an absolute understatement. You can say whatever you want to say about The Miz. He's a loud mouth, but he's the unified tag team champion. He's the United States champion. And the fact of the matter is this guy, Daniel Bryan, has to show some respect for the WWE Pro. His shoulders are down. And Jericho kicks out. Wow, even now, under those circumstances, Chris Jericho digs deep to power out. Abuses him with an elbow. Guys, you're getting ahead of yourself. Oh, no. be some sort of miracle. Oh, boy. See, I told you. Oh, boy. This one's over now. Roll him into the walls of Jericho. Tap him out, Chris. Bryce trying to fight it. Rolls through. What a counter by the technician there. Oh, my oh, God. Peter oh, 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 Hook is in. Jericho's in trouble. Jericho oh, tried it. Is he going to tap? Is he going to tap? He may have no choice. He may, it made it to the bottom rope. You have got to be impressed, Michael, for what we're seeing from Daniel Bryan. Did Daniel, he win yet, Byron? Daniel Bryan thinks he... Oh, mood breaker! You can't allow a veteran like Jericho any time to recover. You're right, Corey. That was a rookie move. And now he's going to pay for it, Byron. That may, very well may be the case, Michael. This loser's going to lose again. Oh. Lion tamer. Can Brian hold on? Tap out, nerd! You got your wish, Cole. Daniel Bryan fought valiantly, but just couldn't the hang with the champ. Yeah, this Chris time, Jericho. experience was just too much for Daniel Bryan. And listen, Miz has got to be so disappointed, and I don't blame him. Luck of the draw, Miz got this loser. 
to be his protege. And now, Miz a little bit of tough whoa, whoa, love here. Whoa, tough love? Give me a break. Tough love. This is ridiculous. Miz is obviously frustrated with his star pupil. Oh, yeah, so you're frustrated, so that's okay. Now you can beat him up? Yeah, start winning some matches, then you won't get beat up anymore. This is ridiculous. What disrespecting? Huh? I'm a champion. Miz has lost his room. mind. Lying on his back, looking at the lights again.